You go to work expecting to do your job. In Iraq, things can quickly take a turn for the worse. Men of 36th Combat Aviation Brigade recently experienced just how quickly a mission can go from routine to urgent. Chief Warrant Officer 3 Jerry Sarden explains what happened. We noticed that uh, one of the aircraft from the other flight was smoking. Uh, after we started watching, we noticed that they had been hit, had taken some small arms fire. And um, they had uh, smoking pretty heavily, and we could tell that they were, were, were going down at that time. For his actions, Chief Sarton was awarded the Silver Star, but he and his crew weren't finished. Uh, my door gunner, uh, Kevin Baumhart, noticed a vehicle speeding away from the, um, from the crash site, and um, we pursued the vehicle. And uh, as we started getting closer to the vehicle, uh, the guys egressed the, air, uh, the, the vehicle and uh, started picking up weapons and started shooting at us. Uh, we were able to neutralize uh, three of the, the, the enemy. The Black Hawk is not an aggressive aircraft. The weapons on board are there to get them out of a situation. The crew knew their mission had changed, but because of battle drill, Sergeant Joseph Linder explained that they were ready for the sudden change. Everything was muscle memory. It was just reflex, everything that happened that day. Uh, everything, it, everything went smooth. So when we would run out of ammo, we would change sides. The pilots... Everything just worked smooth. It was not chaos. It was it, everything was going went by the book like it was supposed to. Chief Sarton says that if we hadn't came along when we did, um, if we hadn't been at the right place at the right time, there was a good chance we probably would have lost another helicopter that there that day. Um, they were set up uh, in an ambush type situation and was ready to, to take on another helicopter. He includes everyone on board his aircraft. We heard the, the fallen angel call, and our pilots asked, you know, you know what, what, what do we want to do? Because everything is a crew effort. We're all part of one crew. And uh, there was no hesitation. The 36th Cav's main mission is troop transport. They keep soldiers off the ground by moving them from point A to point B, all hours, day and night. Our, our main motto is never leave a man behind. And uh, as far as Army aviators, we, we truly do believe in that. Uh, we've got the equipment to actually be able to go in and, and do good. And uh, what we do is, we, you know, we, what we do, we do for the guy sitting next to us. We do for the guy on the ground. Um, we're here to fight, and uh, you know, we'll go in anywhere, anytime to, to, to save one man. Reporting from Logistical Support Area Anaconda, I'm Army Sergeant Kelly Longbine.